All right, Monster Jam fans, welcome to Science Series number 13 at long last. I am so sorry for the extra long wait, but no need to worry about it now because here we are. So anyways, here is the track all complete. Got green on one side and blue on the other side. I designed this myself. It was Hobby Buddy 99 that suggested the color, so thank you, Hobby Buddy. And I can't wait to see what you come up with for the next science series. So here's how it's going to go. We're going to do two truck racing, then triple threat racing, and the return of Hot Wheels racing, or should I say Street Warriors, suggested by uh, Official Tree Rat. Well, he suggested the name because uh, when I heard that these were coming out, uh, I decided I'm going to bring back Hot Wheels Racing once I get all three. And I've got all three, so here we go. And uh, I also did a poll on Instagram uh, asking what I should rename it to because these aren't Hot Wheels cars, and it wouldn't make sense to keep calling it Hot Wheels Racing. So um, I asked everybody, what should I call it? And the first one to uh, respond was Official Tree Rat, and he said Street Warriors, so that's what we're going with. So... Racing, triple threat racing, and uh, street warriors. Uh, long jump will not be part of this. Long jump's taking a little vacation, but it'll be back for the next science series, hopefully. I don't, I don't know, it's too early to tell, despite the fact that I've already written down the lineup. <laughs> All right, so that's the track. So we are going to start off with Megalodon Surf taking on El Toro Loco Earth, but let's look at our field of trucks. So we got me and Bad Company. I'm all ready to go. I got my Bad Company hat on, Bad Company t-shirt, and orange shorts, <laughs> which uh, I, was, I wasn't planning on dressing in colors of Bad Company. Those were just the first shorts I saw when I got home from work. Anyways, uh, Monster Jam Roselle and Bigfoot Bike, XX Alex <laughs> in Grave Digger, Kenshi 08 returning behind the wheel of the Sheer Madness Grave Digger. Brave Prower and Max D, Monster Jam Texas and Maximum Destruction, Ed G and Son of a Digger, Eli Curie 21 and El Toro Loco, Hayden James, his no, Noska, Noska, did I say that right? It Driving El Toro Loco Earth, and Monster Jam Loser and Megalodon Surf. You're not a loser, man. Hobby Buddy 99, my track designing buddy. In Bigfoot, Cody Armstrong, the vengeful one, behind the wheel of Snakebite. Dallas Videos, aka Monster Jam Dallas, the unstoppable, behind the wheel of the brand new Predator. And also we got Monster Jam Collector Racing, in one of the newbies, the, the Back to the Future Time Machine. I can't wait to see how this thing's going to go. And also we got Nathaniel Wiggins and Outlaw, Thomas Wiggins and Sheriff. And then we got Monster Jam Fan OCD2985 and Equalizer. This is Equalizer's first sign-up series. His official debut. Can he get a win? Then we also got Antonio Rodriguez III and Buzz Lightyear. And then Being the Guinea Pig, behind the wheel of the other new truck, Zerg. And then we got Rich Cracker and TNT Unfinished Business. Isaac J16888 and Batman. Monster Jam Loser in Backwards Bob. Wait a sight. Oh, Monster Jam Loser. Well, he's going to be in two trucks. He's going to Brian Barthel this joint. And anyways, the Cameron 9785 in Doomsday. Fluffy the Guinea Pig and Monster Munch Elmation. Door Z in the Advanced Auto Parts Grinder. Monster Jam Stuff and Obsession. Red Stussy making a comeback. It's good to have you back, man. And he is going to be behind the wheel of the Destroyer. Then we also got Kenny12203 in a new truck, the Carbonator. Hot Wheels Float. I could go for a root beer float. And pairing with uh, Carbonator, it is One Bad Scoop, driven by One Bad Ghoul, Rhinomite 2008. Then we got Monster Jam Roselle's son behind the wheel of the Bone Shaker. Monster Jam 26 in Raising Cane, Grave Digger in Wolf's Head. Science Series veteran, the very first champion, Fluffy the Guinea Pig, behind the wheel of The Flash. And last but not least, Dr. Strange the Cat in Pouncer. Yeah, that's right, I got Pouncer. Guy had the Bigfoot open house for 20 bucks. <laughs> Worth it. Yeah, Dr. Strange is in it because he's always pouncing me. He, he loves me. The cat, the cat, not the character. 
All right, so you know the trucks, you know the track, it's Morbin time. <laughs> 